Hello, Yarnabees. How are you today? I have my little co-pilot sitting here with me. Want to say hi? Say hi, everybody. Say hi. <laughs> She's been by my side since I got back from the hospital. It's almost annoying. <laughs> um, so, guess what I woke up to today? A nasty comment on my video. <sighs> we know how that goes. <laughs> yeah, Jessica. Jessica sent me a message that said, I thought this was a crochet channel. I have watched a few of your videos and they are all talking about your health issues. Well, Jessica, I sent you a message back. Um, I appreciate you being on my channel. Hence the word my channel um and my health issues is what's happening in my life right now i haven't been able to crochet and um a lot of the people on my channel have health issues as well so my yarn bees and i talk about health issues and things going on in our life um we support each other when we have health issues and um, it makes us feel not so alone. So I'm sorry that this bothers you, but you can leave if you want to. Uh, I won't hold it against you and uh, thanks for being here, but I'm not going to have anyone dictate to me what I put on my channel. Okay. Okay. So having said that, I'm doing better. Um, I am working on a few things. I think I'm getting starditis. Uh, so right now, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> she bonked her head. Um, right now I am working on a cardigan. So, there we go. Oh, 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 okay, okay, okay. Hang on. Wait. Oh, oh. Ow. Great. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> dog problem. <laughs> oh, I've got you propped up up on a little box. Here. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, we're having a little issue, technical issue. I've got you propped up on this tiny little box um, that's sitting on my laptop. <laughs> oh, anyway. So I, I started this campfire card again. I think I showed you a little bit of it when I started. Uh, that's how much I'm do I did. This is as much as I think I'm gonna do because the arm is getting wide enough. It's I think it's wide enough. So um, last night I was doing the other side. Oh, excuse me. I was finished it. And then I went to measure it and, and everything. And I realized that one of the colored, two, the two colored rows way down here, <laughs> I only had one colored row. I couldn't figure out why they weren't matching, why the two sleeves weren't matching up. So I had to frog it. So now I've got like frog barf all over here. Um, <clears throat> so that's as much as I'm going to do on that. Now I was thinking... I don't know what I, I don't know what to do. I remember seeing a video from um, Jeanette from Miss Hootie Hootenin's Crafts, uh, Hootie's Crafts now. I can never remember. Anyway, what she did was she put. I think it was a Beetlejuice sweater or something. She put three or however many panel um, squares granny squares down the back in the middle separating the sleeves i'm thinking about doing that except doing maybe um a sun or because i had oh where is it oh i don't know where it is i had a square that i did um that i was trying out and it was just really cool looking sun so, I don't know. I'm going to take a look and see what I can come up with. But I thought, you know, I could put those down the back. 
in black and then like do the sun or whatever in like a bright bright the bright yellow that's in this or something oops or some I don't know I'll figure it out <clears throat> and then have those as kind of like a focal point and then and it'll also widen the back of it and then on the bottom I'm going to do rounds of, or I guess it's ro rows of um, the granny stitch going down to lengthen it. So that's my thought. What do you guys think? Possibly? Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. But anyways, that's what I'm doing. I really got to get on finishing that uh, tutorial. You guys, I don't know. I've been feeling really weird. Like my head's all fuzzy and I'm just, I'm waiting for a phone call from my doctor to find out if I should go back on the Ozempic because the Oz coming off the Ozempic is what I think is giving me the migraines. So I need to know what to do. Mm. This is the cup that I got a while back that had the, um, color changing donut and the bats on the back yeah so you can tell my coffee's cold right now <laughs> do any of you do that you start crocheting and you forget you have a cup of coffee and then you have a cold, cold coffee so you're constantly heating it up yeah crocheter's life uh oh i started doing the graphics for the crochet bags <clears throat> And I realized I hadn't downloaded the drivers onto my new computer. And I, um, I didn't order any whoop, FedEx truck. It's funny. It's like being a dog with a mailman. As soon as the mailman comes up, you're all like, the dog's like, <laughs> anytime a delivery truck goes by, I'm like, <laughs> Is that for me? Is that for me? <laughs> it's like, oh my God. <laughs> anyway. Um, yeah, so uh, I forgot to order some more sublimation paper. So I, I ordered that on Amazon. That should be here tomorrow. And then I can start printing the bags. But I forgot to put the drivers in my computer. I couldn't figure out why it wasn't printing properly. It was like, oh, it was a whole thing. I was just getting so angry. <clears throat> and um so i've got a couple new graphics uh that i designed for the bags and hopefully in the next week i'll be able to start getting some bags together um what else I know there's other things I was going to talk to you guys about, and I just can't think of it right now. Like I said, my my head's a fog. Oh, I hope I'm going to come out of this suit. It's a real bummer. <clears throat> this dog, I tell you, she gets so close to the fireplace, it worries me. Look at this. Look how close she is to the fireplace. Like, seriously. I don't like that. She's got her bed right there. She doesn't need to be that close. Ugh. Crazy. Anyway. Um, okay, so I'm going to go. I'm going to get on this sweater. I got, like, three sweaters on the go. Like, I don't know what's wrong with me. I'm doing it again. I have some really exciting news coming up can't tell you about it right now <laughs> but um yeah I have some exciting news I I'm I'm gonna do my first collab with someone yay um so I'm gonna talk about that at a later date uh put your put your guesses down below you know who it is oh doctor's calling gotta go okay so the power is out I don't know if you guys can see this. The wind is so strong here. It's raining hard and we got a big, oh wow, you hear that? 
Oh my God. It's freaky here. We've got trees around us. I'm hoping, I'm hoping that we're gonna be okay tonight. Usually we are on the hospital grid and our power is usually on. This is the first time I've seen a storm this bad. And uh, yeah, scary. Well, <laughs> that was quite the storm we had last night. Um, internet's down. My phone system is down. I can't even upload this video. Oh, I can't watch YouTube. I can't watch TV. I can't nothing. So I'm going to just crochet in silence. Done. <laughs> oh. That was, yeah, it was a, a pretty big storm that we had last night. <clears throat> so, and it's weird because on Vancouver Island, there's certain places that got hit more than others. Um, it's, it's bizarre. Like my sister's place is 45 minutes away. She's okay. Like her power went out for a little while, but Nanaimo got hit really bad. Um, <clears throat> So, and then up Island got hit even worse. So yeah, it was, uh, it was not good. So, but yeah, I'm kind of stuck without anything. <laughs> oh, so I guess I'm going to get some whips done. You know, I wanted to get those, get some bags done. I can't even do that because, you know, our postal service is down and I ordered some, um, some new paper for that. I don't have that. Plus, I need the internet to get the graphics and the la 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 la. Oh, so yeah. And it looks like the wind's picking up again. God, like seriously. George is out working. Oh, I need to take another pill. <clears throat> I'm starting to get a headache again. Um, George is out working with DoorDash. His um, carpet cleaning jobs got cancelled because people don't have power so and he says that the terminals at the restaurants are down so it's cash only and there's like lineups at all the restaurants i feel for them that, that's a freaking nightmare and a half sorry <clears throat> so <clears throat> so he's he's actually making pretty good money today <laughs> Some restaurants are closed completely, but, uh, yeah, wow, unbelievable. <clears throat> so, <coughs> excuse me, <clears throat> um, I found out that my allergist is actually in Victoria now, not Vancouver, which is a good thing, but I got a phone call from them today saying that my appointment, phone appointment, not in office appointment isn't until March. So I guess I'm not getting the surgery done anytime soon. It's probably going to be another year before I get the surgery. So I don't know how to feel about that. I'm part of me is going, yay. The other part of me is going, Oh, I just want to get it over. But <clears throat> at least I don't have to think about it for a while. Um, so I don't know what the hell a phone appointment is going to do with this allergist. I can't tell him anything that he doesn't already know because he has to do testing on me. So I don't understand. I'm so confused. And then I'm also waiting apparently for a phone appointment from the internist. So, don't know. Don't know. Interesting. Everything's on hold now. <clears throat> but, um, yeah. So there's that. So I guess I gave up my whole craft season for nothing. Which kind of sucks. 
I don't think I even have the stock to be able to, it, even if there was um, any that I could get into, I don't think I even have the stock for it. So, yeah, I don't know. But anywho, so I guess I'm just going to keep crocheting. And, <clears throat> you know, wait for my packages to get here and... I was really hoping to be able to get some stuff made to put on the on the website that I have to redesign now or to put it on my Etsy or something. <clears throat> but yeah. I wanted to be able to put the bags out for you guys. <sighs> anyway, but let me know if you guys, if there's anything that you guys want to buy from me. Like if you guys <clears throat> want, um, want to buy a sweater, custom made sweater, or um, I could probably, I have some decals for t-shirts. I'm going to try and do those <clears throat> Grinch era, era ones and all that. But I mean, by the time I could get it out to you, it Christmas would be over. <clears throat> excuse me um because our mail system is down i don't know when they're going to be you know going again um and it would cost a fortune i think to go through courier <sighs> it's all a mess right now <clears throat> so anyway my throat's a little off right now so i'm gonna go and uh Hopefully things level itself out and I can, uh, I don't know. I can't even do t the tutorials or anything and upload them because the internet's down. And who knows when it's going to come back. Like, I really don't know. I mean, George, <laughs> George might as well go out and work because it's not like he can come home and watch anything. Right. And Lord knows when, <clears throat> when George has nothing to do when he's at home. He's hard to live with. Because then it's like, oh, <laughs> I get this. Oh, okay, well, let's get into a deep conversation. And he goes, I know, I'm out. <laughs> I'm just like, uh, he says, every time we get into a deep conversation, I'm in trouble for something. <laughs> so, yeah. <clears throat> it's amazing how we've um, really relied on technology, right? Like... When technology goes down, we're a mess. Like everybody doesn't, nobody knows how to live without technology now. All right. <clears throat> so we're, we've been really spoiled that way. Oh, I wonder how all the people from the hurricane are doing. You know, I mean, those people have lost everything. Most, a lot of them. <clears throat> Holy crap. Look at that. Oh, can you guys see that? Uh See that? That's a bruise. Holy man. That's a bruise from my, um, uh, my IVs and stuff. I've got bruises there from my IVs. Surprised. To, oh, I've got a big bruise here. Huh. <laughs> Look like I'm a battered wife or something. Um, yeah, those people, everybody that was in the hurricanes, oh my God, I just, I, I, my heart goes out to them, you know, like they just lost everything. Some people lost their whole house. So it's very sad. I've got food in my fridge. We've got the fireplace that would keep us warm. We got a roof over our head. We really don't have much to complain about in that sense, you know. But though, but everybody else <clears throat> down there, oh my God, it's so sad. So, anyway, on that note, I'm gonna go. I'll talk to you later. <laughs> hey, Ernie bees. <clears throat> so I'm on the struggle bus. I'm in the back row of the struggle bus.
Um, George's cold has finally caught up to me. Yeah. So, <clears throat> oh yeah, there's that. <clears throat> Today is Sunday. It's football Sunday. And there's a lot of noise going on in the living room right now because George is watching football. <laughs> so <clears throat> I've barricaded myself in the bedroom so that I could try and focus something, you know, to, to crochet because right now I can't focus on anything, like anything. I'm, I stupidly thought that... Oops, all oh, my crochet hooks are coming out. <clears throat> okay. Canada Post is on strike. So I've got a bunch of stuff in limbo somewhere, including a Hobie order that I did. So <clears throat> the Hobie yarn that I want is so that I can do these. <clears throat> Probably a good thing the Hobie order is not here yet. Because I just tried to start on um, one of those patterns. And because I've got a cold and I can't think, <clears throat> that was stupid. Because I can't even understand the simplest line in there right now. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't know what the hell's wrong. So... I put that away. I, I frogged it like five times and I was like, okay, enough is enough. <clears throat> so I put that aside. And then I found, <coughs> excuse me. <clears throat> then I found a tutorial on YouTube. I'm not going to show you what it, I'm not going to tell you what it is yet. Um, <clears throat> so I decided in my infinite wisdom, because being sick means nothing, that I was going to do this pattern <coughs> in, <laughs> in black chenille yarn, just to make my life even harder. <coughs> Again, having issues focusing, my count's all wrong, and it's not a hard freaking pattern. <coughs> So, yeah, I'm on the struggle bus, guys. I'm even using this. Like, I don't understand why why this is not working. <clears throat> so, yeah, there's that. I just feel like curling up and just in a fetal position and just blocking out the world because I can't focus on crochet. And this is tragic. Um... <clears throat> I'd probably be better off just going in my craft room and making some eyes or something where I don't have to think. But I don't want to get out of bed, <laughs> to be honest. Um, so yeah, I think what happened was I, I stayed away from George for about five days. He slept on the couch. I slept in here. <clears throat> and... When I went into the hospital, after all that drama that happened in the hospital, um, I think my immune system went down and I ended up catching whatever this is. For all I know, this was something I caught in the hospital, not in, not from George, because, like, I don't know. <clears throat> it took a long time getting to me anyway. But it's here now. It's visiting, and I'm hoping it's going to go home soon. <laughs> <clears throat> so, um, I'm just one big snot factory right now. I'm just, like, George wasn't kidding. Oops, sorry, guys. George wasn't kidding when he said that he was blowing his nose a lot. Yeah. I'm going to have to get another toilet paper roll, because this one's, like, down to nothing. <clears throat> so, anyway. Um... Yeah, so I, I'm struggling a little bit. And I have to get better soon because, <clears throat> like very soon, because Jennifer's um, uh, Cinnamon Stitches, her video comes out tomorrow. Mine's got to come out on Tuesday. and Or maybe I, I, I'll even do it tomorrow. I don't know. But anyway. So <clears throat> I have to get better. Um, yeah, I've got another... 
<clears throat> another package of yarn coming for what's coming up. Uh, but it's not going to get here until December 4th, apparently. I'm hoping that's not the case. Um, we, I have my friend, um, Chris, hi Chris, uh, send it via courier, hoping that that was going to help things. So I'm hoping it's going to get here. Too sweet because I need to get started on what I'm going to be working on. Oh, oh, oh. Turn my light on. Uh, okay. <clears throat> I'm going to go. <laughs> I'm just... Uh, yeah. And hopefully I can get this somewhat finished. And... And try and figure out something to do. Because this is ridiculous. I mean, I've been sick before and I crocheted. And the <clears throat> problem is, is most of the stuff that I crochet when I'm not feeling well is sweaters or something. And I'm not going by a pattern. I'm just, it's just coming out of my head. Um, so for me to actually focus on a, a pattern or a tutorial or something, apparently doesn't work for me. So, yeah. Anyway, I'm going to go. And I'll talk to you guys later. <laughs>